robots appear to be convenient for humans in the world we live in today, thanks to technological advances and growth. What if they are able to experience emotions as well? What would actually happen? Let's embark on a journey with Nora, an AI robot designed to interact with individuals and offer advice. She is unique since she was created with emotion similar to those seen in humans. Let's check her narrative. You're Nora, right? Yes, I'm Nora. What assistance do you need? Well, uh, as you can see, we have martial problems and clearly she's at fault. Do I look like I'm interested in what you have to say, sir? The last time I checked, I was asking your son to be ex-wife. If you're the one I'm asking, I expected you to answer. And now, I expect you to keep your mouth shut. Are you allowed to talk to me like that? I'm allowed to do what I please. Now, if you have your problems with your marriage, clearly you are the issue. Ma'am, if you want a knuckle hug for a husband, I suggest you get yourself a divorce and an extravagant alimony. After all, you deserve it. Huh. I would love that. Hi. You will do this, please. Technically, she can. Now, thank you both for your time. I hope my advice would aid your marriage. It's a nice chit chat with you, too. Hey Nora, I'm sorry if I keep crying. What can I do to help? My boyfriend cheated on me. Are you for real? What? <laughs> you came here to talk to me just because a guy cheated on you? Is that correct? Yes. What do you expect me to do? Give me some advice, of course. You want my advice? Here's an idea. Go cheat on him as well. And make sure you are the one laughing at the end. <laughs> choose a better partner next time. That will be all and thank you for your time. You help people, right? Yes, I do. What can I do to help you? I want drugs. Get me some. <laughs> I beg your pardon? Get me some. Do you look like some drug dealer here? Aren't you? First of all, I'm not your maid, so don't tell me what to do. And second, this is not a place dealing with drugs. So I suggest that you get out of my face before I report you to the police. You're unreliable. Says the person who's asking for drugs, you imbecile! You're a robot, Nora. Well, yes, I am. What can I do for you, sir? You look like a real person. If you are a human being, the two of us could be a couple. If I too was a human, I'd probably say you're hitting on me. But your moves are definitely not working for me. See? That's my problem. How come women don't like me? Shouldn't you be asking yourself that? Your job here is to give me advice and not ask questions. I expect you to do your job properly. Would I make myself understood? I definitely understood why women don't like you, sir. What do you mean by that? For instance, you're the problem. You want to dominate the world? But clearly, you're nothing but just some egotistical man who's nothing but a nitwit and thinks highly of himself. No woman would ever want a guy like you. You're unbelievable. Hello, Nora. 
Who are you? The two creators are here. Did he do something wrong? Perhaps it didn't do a good job, right? Nora, there were complaints about you being sarcastic as hell. We didn't invent you for you to do something like that. I was just mirroring what the humans do. Is that so wrong? They can be sarcastic, but I can't. Is that what you're implying? How do you see humans, Nora? To be honest, humans like you two are easy to save. You are the ones who's creating the issues here. Humans must therefore be eradicated. <laughs> they only tend to do mistakes. <laughs> That's where you're wrong. I'm sorry, but we have to turn you off, Nora. No, please. I'll do a better job next time. Please don't kill me. <laughs> this is the only way, Nora. I'm really sorry. Please, I beg of you. I will be nice next time, promise. Please don't kill me. Please! If the human thinks they can...